Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. People, the hype is truly upon us. We have breaking news of the very first cover story for Avatar 2. Empire Magazine will be running the first cover story for Avatar 2 on July 7th. Today they showed us the cover, but we do have some new information they also decided to share with us today before the magazine releases. So in this video, let's dive right into that, and if you don't mind, I'll read along with the article sharing the news. When James Cameron makes a movie, he aims to blow your mind. Just look at the Terminator, or Terminator 2, or Aliens, or Titanic. Mind-blowing is his default mode, so when Cameron unleashed Avatar on a largely unsuspecting public in 2009, it's no surprise that it became the biggest movie of all time. Transporting slack-jawed audiences to the bioluminescent paradise of Pandora in a sci-fi B-movie blockbuster of epic proportion. Now he's getting ready to do it again, not once, but four times over, with a quartet of supersized sequels that take Jake, Neytiri, and their Navi family out into the wider world and off to pastures new. First out of the gate is Avatar The Way of Water a film that'll dive deep into the unexplored oceans of Pandora with new tribes, new creatures, and a whole new adventure to unfold. Get ready, James Cameron is about to blow your mind all over again. The new issue of Empire takes a major world exclusive look at Avatar The Way of Water and its follow-up films, heading to Cameron's Lightstorm HQ to get the inside story on an epic aquatic new saga. Prepare to meet the water-dwelling Metkaina tribe, learn more about the fearsome foes waging war this time around, discover the secrets of Jake and Aetiri's family, and believe us, there are some serious secrets, and dig into Cameron's wider plan for the four movies. It's an issue with unparalleled access to the film and its cast and crew. Featuring interviews with Cameron himself, producer John Landau, and the stars of the movie, and plenty more. Plus, it's stacked with never-before-seen images that offer you the best look yet at what's in store. This is your ticket to a whole new age of Pandora. And if all that wasn't exciting enough, they gave us a new look and new information about Kate Winslet's character, Ronail. Yes, that's right, they revealed the name is pronounced Ronail. So let's get into the image and new information. Last time Kate Winslet teamed up with James Cameron on a little film about a very big boat, they made cinematic history. Now they're about to change the game all over again, with an appropriately aquatic comeback. Winslet is working with the director once more on a long-awaited sequel, Avatar The Way of Water. Their reunion is, in so many ways, titanic news. But for all the similarities to their last collaboration, Winslet is playing a very different character here than the love-struck Rose. As seen on the cover of our world exclusive new Avatar The Way of Water issue, we can exclusively reveal that Winslet's character is Navi warrior Ronail, along with Cliff Curtis's Tonawari. Ronail leads the Metkaina tribe who dwell in the shallows of Pandora's vast oceans and will play a major part in the upcoming adventure. She is deeply loyal and a fearless leader, Winslet tells Empire of her big blue alien teasing a female action hero in a similar mold to Sarah Connor, Ripley, and Avatar's own Neytiri. She is strong, a warrior, even in the face of grave danger, and with an unborn baby on board, she still joins her people and fights for what she holds most dear, her family and their home. When Sam Worthington's Jake and Zoe Saldana's Neytiri are displaced from their home and flee to the Metkaina's water world, expect friction. The drama and conflict that tends to follow the Soli clan around means they won't necessarily be welcomed with open arms. For Winslet, working again with Cameron was a significant event, though their dynamic has shifted somewhat in the years since they made Titanic and smashed box office records the world over. Winslet was at one with the water this time around, throwing herself into the deep end for the underwater shooting with her now legendary free diving proficiency. How long did she stay under with a single breath? 7 minutes and 14 seconds, baby, she says, adding that the most amazing thing for me as a middle-aged woman was to learn something not just new, 
but superhuman. Get ready to return to the heart of the ocean. So there you have it guys. We won't get the full cover story until July 7th, but this was already a lot of great new information. For me, now I know how to properly pronounce her name, but most importantly, she is a co-leader of the Metkaina tribe along with Tonawari. And this new image of them is amazing. Can't wait to get all the other details they are set to release on July 7th. Let me know what you all think in the comment section below. And as always, thank you for watching and I will catch you all in the next video.